What's up guys, welcome back to another video. And today guys, real quick, I want to give you all a quick heads up on what's coming on in the future. So guys, if you all want to have a little bit of a discussion down in the comments section below on equipment, let me know what you guys want to see because what we're getting ready to do is something I haven't done in a very long time and that's going to be a big working cattle farm we're going to kick off the old cattle server once again and that will be coming at the end of the month so real quick guys do me a favor if you guys love the cattle farm series doing livestock running cattle working cattle doing everything involving cattle hit that subscribe button hit the like button help out the channel here we are Getting fired back up, getting fired back up on all cylinders. And let's kind of check out how I got the setup so far. So as you come into the main farm, we're going to have sheds set up. We got two solid bunkers set up, ready to rock and roll. We'll have our main equipment storage right here. To our left hand side, this would be our main equipment storage for combines, forage harvesters, implements, planters, gotta plant corn, gotta have silage. So we'll have our corn equipment over here, we'll also we'll have a combine or two to shell some corn as well, as well as some soybeans. So we'll move over here, we got our first bunker. Then we'll have our second bunker over here. Just pretty much getting things going. We'll have some more equipment storage right here. And then we'll also have our bale storage as well. So this bar will hold like one side's going to be straw, one side's going to be hay. So we're going to have to do weed as well just to make everything work we also have our cow our cattle barns we'll be running dairy and we'll be run, also running beef so our two uh, productions here will be this one will be dairy this will also be dairy And then our open pasture, I'm not yet done setting up on open pasture, but this one here will be a beef pasture. Let's go ahead and let's go ahead and set ourselves one more cow pasture. For our calves. We'll set that right here. Let's go ahead and add ourselves an extra cow barn. And we'll uh, flatten everything out to just kind of make it a little bit more uniformed. I don't know what goes right there. We'll figure that out later. So this is pretty much our setup for right now, just to get ourselves going. We got our manure pits here in the back. So a lot to come in the future of everything. Uh, so guys, if y'all are still watching to this point, bleep bloop down in the comment section, what kind of equipment you guys want to see? on this uh, cattle server. So let me set the uh, point here. Let's come up here. Let's go to tractors. Uh, open station. Of course we'll have our John Deere's. Um. 
you would think this tractor would have a front loader. But we'll have a lot of the open station tractors. We'll have enclosed station. I want to mix it up. So something like this. We'll buy a couple pieces of machine just so you guys can see what we what my mind is thinking or what we can have. Now let's get ourselves a uh, 4255 open station here. No front loader. a hauler come down here front loaders should have a new one new hauling one yep there's a new hauling and we'll do uh, we also got the Kubota pack I believe this one is compatible with this machine I guess this hauler one does not like this tractor. So let's use the other one. See if this one works. Let's put super strength on. I hope this works for this machine. Oh yeah. It's a little big, but it'll work. And of course we'll have... Like, this Forge Harvester has a special sound to it, so... It actually sounds realistic. 
We'll have uh, multiple tractors to pick from as well. We got Case, Kubota, Deer, New Holland, White, Fent. Like, I want to give you all the most options as well. So, I'm going to start buying some implements. Just getting ourselves somewhat ready. Uh, let's go with... And I'll probably add the Anderson stuff too, so... 180 horsepower tractor required for that. So let's buy that. Need 180 plus, so we'll buy... Let's buy a T7. Actually, for a tractor to be doing that kind of work, let's just do a T6 two-wheel drive. So this will be our feeder tractor. Then we'll need to go ahead and go to implements. Let's buy some buckets. One new bucket. Um, hmm. Actually, we're going by John Deere real quick. I do love these old school tractors. Row crop, fender. Six forty, the old school decals, bucket. So there we go. We have gotten our start of our setup. So guys, again, I want to let you all know we are got the cattle server going up at the end of the month. So guys, let me know what you all want to see in the future videos. Anyways, guys, thank you all so much for watching. Hope you all enjoy. We'll see you all in the next one. Have a good one. Be safe. And we'll see you all later.